Okay, we have an unboxing and a first look. Um, this is a watch from Bernhardt Watch Company, B-E-R-N-H-A-R-D-T, out of North Carolina. And this is an unboxing and a first look. Um, this particular watch is a binnacle diver. It used to be called a sea shark, but they had to change the name because of some copyright issue or whatever, and easier to change the name than to fight. Um, a lawsuit and so a new, new name binnacle diver it's the same watch basically as the old sea shark very nice packaging very nice zipper case and let's see here comes with a couple of cards identity card with a date this is a you know as far as a quality watch, this is relatively inexpensive for what you get. They're under $300 shipped. Um, let me let you see this top part of the case, what that looks like. Um, and I'll go into, I'm going to do a full review in another video, but um, I'll go into all the details about the watch. But suffice it to say, it's, it's certainly, from what I've read, it's worth a look. And to feel it just right out of the box, um, nice heft to it. The band feels very solid. Watch looks very attractive. Um, a couple of things about this watch, and again, this is just a first look video, and I'll be doing another video um, after I've sized it and worn it for a few days. But a couple of key things, it has screws in the band know how close I can get this to focus and not pins not pressure pins which is very nice these these are like four millimeters thick they're even thicker than the links on my Invicta 9937 which it has thin links in and of itself and you see here if you open this it's got plastic on it and all I haven't taken that off but you can see how that's constructed, very heavy. That, those aren't just stamped pieces for the scissor hinge. This piece here could be a little bit thicker, but that's about the same as the Invicta, which is about the same price. Comes with a two-year warranty. So far, I'm, I'm very impressed. It, it's Comparable in some ways to the Invicta, Invicta 9937, which I reviewed earlier. In some ways, I think it seems to be a little bit better than that. Let's put them side by side here. Take the Invicta off. And again, the plastic is still on this watch and all. It's just a first look. Um, but there you can see the size of the Bernhardt might be a little bit larger just a little bit but they're very comparable and just my initial look if I had to give one an edge over the other I'd say the Bernhardt binnacle diver might have a, a slight edge on the Invicta so far but we're gonna see how well it keeps time and the other thing is the Invicta does have a, a date on it I like the clean look of the Bernhardt face, though. Very easy to read, very big hands. Okay, just as a follow-up, I've taken all the plastic off the watch, and I have sized the band. It has quite a few links. I had to take out um, two links on one side and one link on the other. And again, it screws. It's a 1.5 um, straight blade screwdriver. And um, while I was at it, I snugged up all the other screws in the band. Make sure you do that, or if you have a jeweler size it, make sure you have them check all the screws. Make sure they're all tight. Um, so far, very impressive watch. When you set this, it does not have the hacking mechanism where when you pull it out, it stops the second hand. So, so um, for some people that might be an issue, not a big issue for me. Uh, I don't have to have the watch right on the second. Um, that's one way they save costs. The, the movement, the automatic movement in this isn't quite as expensive as some more expensive watches. But from what I understand, it's a workhorse movement, very rugged and um, holds up. So um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, test this for a few days and then I'm going to uh, 
I'll probably just append the notes in this video with um, how fast or slow it's running and other impressions that I have but I can tell you right now that this this watch is is really a well-made piece for under three hundred dollars just under three hundred dollars I've had a number of, of Rolex watches and you know I have a, a Rolex now currently and um, the quality of this watch is right up there as far as the band the case the crown the face is gorgeous I mean this this watch I don't know how they do it I don't know how this North Carolina company delivers this watch at the price point that they deliver it at but kudos to them for doing it nice solid watch Bernhardt Binnacle Diver they have a few other models as well some of which are very attractive um, and they're in stock which is nice some watches that are high quality that are in the similar price range and so forth are always sold out and very hard to get these at least at this point in time are in stock just in case you did want to see what it looks like on the wrist um, there's a quick shot of it on the wrist feels very comfortable man feels very good as far as comfort uh, equally equal in comfort to uh, my Invicta 9937 which is also a very comfortable watch to wear so there you go and this one though is, is even more readable with those nice bright white hands and the markers extremely readable